Okay, folks, so this is how our camper goes down. Dave is pushing a button on the inside and you are watching it lower. So we're gonna see how long it takes to go all the way down, but you can see it's kind of folding up and that makes it a lot more aerodynamic for us to travel with. But we have to really make sure inside that everything is clear so we don't um, end up with something in between where it needs to close. But there we go, it took less than a minute. This is our trailer, it's a Safari Condo Alto. Ours uh, we purchased in Canada, in Quebec. There was a really long lead time. And um, some of the features that we got that we really, really would definitely buy again are the Max Fan on the top, the solar panels, absolutely. We can charge our phone in here, even off grid like we are today. We did get the Caravan Mover which is this thing down here. And uh, right now Dave has it engaged, my husband. Um, so the, the mover is connected to the wheel and he moves it by remote control and he can move it anywhere he wants. We're not putting the car, um, backing up the car to the trailer. He moved the trailer to match, to come up to the car. So that's all something you can see. Some people call this a marriage saver. <laughs> it's not a lot of yelling going on. And uh, so he's putting the trailer in the car. It is where we are. It's uh, 7.15 in the morning. So we're getting out early. And, um, and that means you got to be organized. And this has to be somewhat easy. And it is. And so the other bars that he has down there on the um, pavement is our, our sway bars that get attached uh, to the trailer to um, just help keep it from swaying just like the word says, that wheel's gonna come off. So it's got some toggle bolts um, that he's unscrewing right now to pull off the wheel and it goes in a compartment in the back. And, and then there's, there's safety chains, there's electric that gets connected. So that is the air conditioner vent down there. Uh, we do have electric outside and we have 12 volts outside. We did get that. We did get the dimmer switch on the lights, on the LED lights on the inside, which we like. Um, this is a storage container in the back, and um, it does have a toilet. We use a toilet for storage primarily. We haven't been using it because we've camped and never used it. We always stay in places that have a toilet. And just so you can see, I showed you an RV park recently, and this is, this is what a not RV park looks like. And you can see that's our neighbor across the street. Um, the neighbor in the yellow tent is two campsites down, actually. So there's nobody in between us. But you can see the campsites. You can see how much more rustic it is. Those lights um, in front of the right car and the red car and then the building back there is the bathroom. And this is our next door neighbor on this side. So it's really far. Um, lots. And then there's nobody behind us. And uh, we had a deer last night in our campsite. If you have a tent, this one, this is campsite 99. Uh, at Mammoth um, National Park, Mammoth Cave National Park, and this has got a huge tent spot. Um, so this is, uh, I'll show you a little bit more of the bathroom. People always want to see that. Um, I just walked down there. It's pretty close. So the, for me, this has got a flush toilet. It has um, sinks. It had electric in it. it has baby changing stations, uh, water. There's a water station here, and someone else is cleaning it. <laughs> and most places it gets cleaned really regularly. This one is super clean and uh, well-maintained. And then even the path at night was lit. And so you can see that's the path to the bathroom. And that's another tent campsite. And so just another look at our campsite here. This is a great campsite, great campground. And uh, you can see our spot. And this is what camping off-grid looks like. And this is what we love about camping, is this kind of camping. Not so much the RV parks, but if you're gonna be in the city, it's pretty much all you're gonna get. And that was great too. So, but for, for the relaxation lifestyle, this is it for us. So that's it from Mammoth Cave National Park in Kentucky. 
you enjoyed this video, hit subscribe. For more free information on safe building, avoiding mold, and water damage, visit avoidingmold.com.